O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. Our Lord, the path of suffering trod, and since his blood for man has flowed, Tis meet that man should yield to God the life he owes. Alleluia. No shame to own the crucified. Nay, tis our immortality that we confess our God who died and for him die. Alleluia. Beholding his predestined crown, into their psalms the martyr goes. Dying he conquers death overthrown, overthrows his foes, alleluia. Lord, make us your own soldiers true, grant us brave faith, a spirit pure. That for your name, your cross in view, we may endure. Alleluia. You, O Lord, are close. Your ways are truth. I call on my heart, Lord, hear me. I will keep your commands. I call upon you, save me, and I will do your will. I rise before dawn and cry for help. I hope in your word. My eyes watch for the night to ponder your promise. In your love hear my voice, O Lord. Give me life by your decrees. Those who humbly and justly draw near, they are far from your law. But you, O Lord, are close. Your commands are truth. Long have I known that your will is established forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. You, O Lord, are close. Your ways are truth. Lord, let your wisdom be with me, to help me and to work with me. O God of my fathers and Lord of mercy, who have made all things by your word, and by your wisdom have formed man, to have dominion over the creatures you have made, and rule the world in holiness and righteousness, and pronounce judgment in uprightness of soul, give me the wisdom that sits by your throne, and do not reject me from among your servants. For I am your slave, and the son of your maid servant a man who is weak and short-lived, with little understanding of judgment and laws. For even if one is perfect among the sons of men, yet without the wisdom that comes from you, he will be regarded as nothing. With you is wisdom, who knows your works, and was present when you made the world, and who understands what is pleasing in your sight, and what is right according to your commandments. Send her forth from the holy heavens, and from the throne of your glory send her, that she may be with me in toil, and that I may learn what is pleasing to you. For she knows and understands all things, and she will guide me wisely in my actions, and guard me with her glory. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
Lord, let your wisdom be with me, to help me, and to work with me. The truth of the Lord will stand firm forever. O oh, praise the Lord, all you nations, acclaim all you peoples. Strong is his love for us, he is faithful forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. The truth of the Lord will stand firm forever. Let us give thanks to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the merciful Father, the God from whom all help comes. He helps us in all our troubles, so that we are able to help those who have all kinds of troubles using the same help that we ourselves have received from God. Just as we have a share in Christ's many sufferings, so also through Christ we share in his great help. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. He is my salvation, the Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my strength, I will sing praise to him. Anyone who hates his soul in this world will save it for the eternal life. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David, his servant as he promised by the lips of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old, a saviour who would raise from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us, so his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham, our father, to grant us that free from fear and save from the hands of our foes. We might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins. The loving kindness of the heart of our God He visits us like the dawn from on high He will give light to those in darkness Those who dwell in the shadow of death And guide us into the way of peace Give praise to the Father Almighty to his Son, Jesus Christ, the Lord. To the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Anyone who hates his soul in this world 
will save it for the eternal life. Through the martyrs who were slain for God's word, let us give glory to our Saviour, the faithful and true witness. He redeemed us by your precious blood. Through the martyrs who bore witness to your love, set us free to live for you. You redeemed us by your precious blood. Through the martyrs who proclaimed your saving death, give us a deep and constant faith. You redeemed us by your precious blood. Through the martyrs who took up your cross, grant us courage for every trial. You redeemed us by your precious blood. Through the martyrs washed in the blood of the Lamb, give us grace to conquer our weakness. You redeemed us by your precious blood at the Saviour's command and formed by divine teaching we dare to say Our Father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord God, listen in your kindness to your people's prayer. As we joyfully celebrate the martyrdom of St. Callistus, may his merits come to our aid. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us, and keep us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.